Only a few years back, working from home was a rare opportunity which only entrepreneurs used to have. Even to this day, it is a luxury which many people do not have. Every day, they have to rush to commute to reach and spend time at their traditional job or office, and with the increase in population it is getting harder and harder. But things are shifting now as millions of people have entered the gig economy and are earning quite a handsome amount of money. Maybe the global pandemic gave it a necessary push but it was on the rise even before that. Hello guys, and welcome to our channel. Today's video is about the gig economy. If you are not familiar with the term, watch the video till the end and learn everything about it. But first make sure you like and subscribe to our channel. Also, click the bell icon so that you do not miss any of our videos. So let's get started. The driving factor for working from home is an internet connection, as with the advent of the internet, it became easier to find work across the globe. People saw an opportunity to skip the unnecessary personnel between clients and the contractors and created online platforms where customers and service providers can negotiate directly making it facile for both parties. The term used for such types of jobs is freelancing. Since it was founded back in 2009, the freelancer market has seen a huge exponential growth, especially in the recent decade or so. Today millions of people are working on these platforms, and are adding to the trillion dollar gig economy. The gig economy basically is a free market where individuals or companies hire self-governing employees or freelancers for only a single gig or multiple projects as per they wish. Initially used by musicians, the word gig now is used as slang for jobs which are for shorter periods of time. The gig economy can also be defined as a job where employees and the employer meet on online platforms via the internet, and agree to work together. Jobs included in the gig economy are numerous and they provide exceptional services to their clients. Examples include, Upwork, Belay Solutions where one can find virtual assistants, Uber and Lyft providing transportation, content writers, video editors, and whatnot on platforms like Fiverr and Upwork, delivery services providing groceries, medicine and food deliveries, like Amazon and Uber. There are some who provide labor support as well. During the past few years demand for online content has skyrocketed. Videos, websites, blogs, everything needs content. With the increase in demand supply increases as well. Search engine optimization experts might maintain your site or accounts or pages, but creating content is a creative art and is a whole other niche. This increases the demand for freelancers and their services. From writing to music production, the gig economy has something for everyone. Everything has some good aspects as well as negative ones. Gig economy has its advantages and disadvantages. Just like with anything else in life, there are pros and cons of working in the gig economy. Advantages of Gig Economy Job Freedom to Work There are various benefits of the gig economy but having freedom to work as you desire is the top rated. It provides you independence to choose when and where you work. It gives you a choice to reject a task if you are not willing to take it. This type of freedom is not available in a traditional job. Flexible Working Hours Apart from the freedom which freelancing offers you, it gives you the opportunity to work only those hours which you feel comfortable with. There is no 9 to 5 routine which often seems a burden to people. If you are one of those people, online working is the way forward for you as it can be adjusted to your daily routine. If you feel like skipping a work day, you can certainly have that flexibility and can return to work later on when you feel better. Vast number of opportunities. If you check out platforms like Upwork and Fiverr, you will be amazed to see the massive working options available there. So getting a project will never be a problem for you anymore. Your expertise does not matter as these platforms have a place and work for every kind of professional. High Income Some of the sites offering freelancing jobs work on the principle of customers looking for sellers and hiring them for their services, while on other platforms work on a type of bidding system. A client posts a job on the platform, and freelancers bid and offer various prices to get a contract. Now, you might think that the one offering the lowest price will get the contract but it is not always so. Companies take into account other factors as well, and more often than not they pay more in order to get the greater quality of services. Side Hustle if you have a regular job that is great, but the gig economy provides a unique opportunity to earn money through other means. Freelancing presents you with a chance to earn money doing what you love or what you are good at. 
As impressive and attractive the gig economy sounds, it has its fair share of drawbacks as well. The beginner's struggle. Gig economy has become a major market, and flux of people is in great numbers. Platforms like Fiverr and Upwork have thousands of people, offering services related to a single job. It makes the competition tough. Standing out from the rest especially when you do not have the experience or particular clientele base can be a daunting task. To attract customers, you will have to lower your price or provide discounts until you make a name for yourself. No Benefits Working as a freelancer is great, and those who are doing it full-time are earning quite a fortune. However, unlike traditional jobs, it has no benefits be it allowances or retirement money. You will have to take care of your future as well. Lonely Job As flexible as gig economy jobs are, it comes with the drawback of being isolated at home, a kind of quarantine feeling. So, if you like to have humans around each and every day, freelancing might not be the market for you. Not everyone is cut out to handle that loneliness, and some even fall into depression. But if you are okay with it all, then you must give it a go. Due to the recent global crisis, economies have been hit hard. Population is increasing, and the opportunities are decreasing. Traditional jobs are still preferred by many, but the new generations are being drawn to the gig economy and online platforms. The way it is going, soon the gig economy will compete head-to-head -head with the traditional job market. That is the end of our video. Hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, then hit the like button, subscribe, and don't forget to press the bell icon to receive instant updates from our channel. Share your thoughts, comments below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.